Welcome everyone to Neverwinter on PC. My name is Reiner and today we're going to check whether VIP is still profitable. If you enjoyed this video please leave a like and if you would like to see more information on videos about Neverwinter hit the subscribe button. We all know that in the past you could buy VIP, get your daily key, sell the contents and come out with a profit AD wise. However there have been some changes in this context. First of all, well, lockboxes have been made a bit crappy in my opinion uh, because they do not drop the packs inside the, the lockboxes anymore. For opening videos this is just, well, annoying. Uh, another change that affects the value of VIP is the Zen Exchange. The Zen Exchange is the way to turn your AD you got from selling the contents of the lockboxes back into Zen so that you can buy VIP again. The Zex limit has been changed with the release of mod 16 up to 750 AD%. And of course the Zex on PC is immediately kept again as you can see 16 million Zen requested at 750. So that means basically that Zen has become 50% more expensive. Now, let's look at the options for buying Zen, uh, for buying Zen, for buying VIP. You can buy one month of VIP, three months or six months, or actually 30, 30 days of VIP, 90 days of VIP or 180 days of VIP, which isn't quite the same, but okay. You will never buy VIP full price as they are here right now. Best is to wait for a 40 to 50% discount, which we have twice per year approximately. But let's take that one out of the picture because it can not be the case and take the more accessible 20% off voucher that everyone can get pretty regularly. I've made an overview that shows the prices of VIP per key and you can see this here. If you buy VIP with a 20% off voucher, it only costs 800 Zen, which is if you take 750 Zen per AD, 600,000 AD. You get 30 keys, so that means you only spend 20,000 AD per key, which is not that much. If you go for 3 months, you actually spend less per key, because you can buy 3 months or 90 days for 2,160 Zen. It costs you 1.62 million, you get 90 keys, and it's 18,000 AD per Zen. As you can see, the six months is even cheaper. You can see it on the screen, I don't have to read it out loud, but AD cost per key is only 17,000. Now, we have to do something with those keys, of course. Uh, we're getting a key each day, so I am taking into account that you are going to pick up every day uh, your key. If you miss one, of course, this is a little bit off again but we have to we have a choice which lockbox to open i'm not going to go through every single one because there are just too many but i will take the last four lockboxes we had excluding the glorious resurgence lockbox because for some reason i did not do a test on the latest version of it oops doesn't matter we will look at the lockbox of the mad mage so the current one the Acquired Treasures logbox, the Undying logbox, and the Soulmongers logbox. And how are we going to figure out the value inside? Well, here's where my Bag Value Analyze tool comes in. And I will give you guys a live demonstration. A couple things before we start though. Each logbox, as many tests have shown, contains on average 8 trade bars. Actually slightly more, but let's take 8. For eight trade bars, uh, eight trade bars, we can buy in consumables one scroll of mass life, and one scroll of mass life on the auction house is worth three thousand five hundred AD, and that's gonna stay the same. So I don't think that's going to go down anytime soon. So yeah, that's pretty okay. So I'm going to add one scroll of mass life to each logbox to determine the value. As for the companion upgrade tokens, which are also in there, which you cannot sell on the auction house, I will determine the price based 
on the Epic to Legendary upgrade, which costs either 1 million AD or 120 companion upgrade tokens, which means that 5 companion upgrade tokens are worth 41,667 AD. Just trust me on that one. So let's go to the bag value analyzer tool. It's here. I already selected the logbox of the mad mage, which will be the first one. I set the amount of keys to 30. So this is the amount of keys that you can get for one month of VIP. And I already figured out the values because doing this live would be way too slow. So I'm going to add them in here. And I'm going to, as I said, add the uh, scroll of mass life in here like this and now we can see how much um, value you get out of one month or 30 days of the lockbox of the mad mage total ad you get out of this is 1.775 million so 1.776 almost and ad per container is 59,198 ad which is quite good so let's get the price back. Uh, let me put that, oops, let me put that here because we're going to have some room here. And you can see that you will definitely make a profit with this logbox on average, of course, on average, quite a bit. If you do 30 days, you have, instead of about 600,000 AD cost, you make 1.7 million. So I have over a million profit if you do 90 keys, you get 5.3 million and the cost of three months is 1.6 million. So that's also quite a lot of profit. And of course, 180 days is also quite a lot of profit. You basically get about three times your money back. So let's go to the second logbox that is uh, the acquired treasures logbox. And let's set it to 30 keys again. We're going to add the scroll of mass life and include it here. Let's fill in all of the values. So as you can see, the, the trade by jackpot I set to zero because this is already in the average of eight. For the acquired treasures, 30 log boxes. Uh, why is this so crazy? Whoops, I set this, I copied wrong. My bad. All right, so the acquired treasures log box, once again, is also per container, totally worth it. If you buy one month, three months or six months, you're totally going to get more than twice your money back, almost three times. For 90 days, you're getting over 5 million again, once again, and 180 days, you get over 10 million. So this is definitely also worth it. One thing to note, if you buy single keys, uh, so I'm going to drift off topic for now. If you buy one key, that's actually the same as this. So one key gives you about on average 55,781 AD. If you buy a singular key on the Zen store, it will cost you 125 Zen. But of course you're going to use a 40% off voucher, so it's 75 Zen which means it costs you 56,250 AD. So singular keys are not really worth it in this case. For the Undying, we saw it's slightly above, so it, it was worth it, but very on the edge. But yeah, I will do the same also for the uh, last two Undying logbox. Let's do 31st. And dying, let me add the scrolls of mass life. Is this okay? No, I have to do it like this. Exactly. Let me copy the values in the correct column this time. Now you can see that 30 undying log boxes gives you 1.5 million. So once again, you will definitely get a profit with VIP per key is the value down here. It's only 51,000 per key. As I said, one key costs 56,250. If you buy loose keys, 
there also are different packs but you cannot use the 40% off voucher so let's not take those all, all of them into account it's going to get too complicated but loose keys are not that great VIP is but loose keys no uh, let's look at the last one, the Soulmongers lockbox, and then I'm going to show you guys an overview of all of the results because that's very useful. Because this is hard to keep up, of course. So let's take a look at the last one, the Soulmongers. Add in the values, and the water Ceratops is actually worth quite a bit right now on the auction house. You can see that a deeper container is above 64,000. So in this case, actually loose keys are still worth it. Just just about. Well, you also have the auction house fee, so nah, not really. Anyway, here once again, 30 keys are worth almost 2 million already. 90 keys are 5.8 million and 180 keys are worth 11.6 million. So, is VIP worth it to buy? And will you get your AD back if you buy VIP? Not even taking into account the additional perks, which are already worth it in my opinion. Um, the answer is very easily yes. You will definitely get your money back. If you buy the correct box, you will get three times your money back. So VIP definitely still is a thing. Definitely worth the buy. So here is the price still, and I will show you now the overview of the results. So one month of VIP costs 600,000 AD, and here you can see each of these log boxes for 30 keys, you get over one and a half million AD. The Soulmongers log box out of these four actually seems to be the best one. For 30, 30 days, of course, it's the same. You also get a lot more back than you uh, spend, and for the six months also, of course. It's only logical, because if one month is profitable, then three months definitely also is be even more profitable, because you, get, uh, you spend less AD per key. So VIP, still buy it. If you can, buy as much as at the same time as you can. Buy the six months if you can. If not, buy the three months, otherwise buy the one month. Best is to do it during a big discount. So that's it for this video. If you have any remarks on this video or any suggestions on what to investigate next, feel free to leave a comment below and don't forget to subscribe. Thank you so much for watching and see you in the next video.